This brand new cycling and walking bridge was opened on the 20th of February 2019. A very long curved concrete bridge over an also new turbo roundabout. Very close to the German border in Limburg, the most southern province in the Netherlands. Near Schinveld in the municipality of Beekdalen, which is in turn in the developing urban region of Parkstad. The N274 to Roermond via Germany was expanded. At the last Dutch intersection, just 500 meters from the German border, here in the distance, a new turbo roundabout was constructed. Under the Dutch sustainable safety policies, turbo roundabouts should not be combined with level crossings for cycling and walking. That is why the huge cycle bridge was part of the road expansion project. The bridge was designed by artist Marijke de Groei in collaboration with IPV Delft. The concrete part is 190 meters long and the artist integrated a three-piece work of art. Including the access ramps, the total bridge is 330 meters long. There is one sculpture, a blue metal cube, on the east side. The second part of the artwork consists of two cubes on top of each other on the west side and in the middle of the bridge, right above the turbo roundabout, a number of cubes were stacked to emphasize this bridge is a landmark gateway to the Parkstadt region. The white concrete was cast in situ, which means that it was poured into its specific form on this location. This creates a single long curve and the 28 meter long spans between the pillars could be kept very slender for an open view, embedding the bridge in the rural landscape as one continuous horizontal line. The railings, however, have no horizontal bars. The LED lights are integrated in the handrail. The railings are shaped as a lattice girder with fine stainless steel bars that will keep their clean look. This delicate design is continuous on the entire bridge. A lot of people, mostly using this bridge for the first time, stopped to enjoy the new view from it. The embankments on either side of the bridge offer a long and easy access to it. The east access seemed a bit shorter and therefore steeper, but both ends can be conquered in a comfortable way on an ordinary Dutch upright bicycle. All kinds of people came to watch the new bridge, even people on a side-by-side -side bicycle. No matter where you are in the Netherlands, even in a remote corner, you can find excellent cycling infrastructure.